I wrote actually as kind of a response to um, in the last couple of years the media have had a really wonderful fixation on kind of painting me as like the psycho serial dater girl. It's been awesome. I've loved it. And they're like, you know, it was, it got pretty out of control there for a couple of years because it would be like, every article was like, Taylor Swift standing near some guy. Watch out, guy. And, you know, Every single article was kind of like, um, had these descriptions of my personality that were very different from the actual personality. And the first, my first reaction was to be like, man, that's a bummer. This isn't fun for me. But then my second reaction ended up being like, hey, that's actually kind of a really interesting character they're writing about. Like, she jet sets around the world collecting men and then, and she can get any of them, and then, but she's so clingy that they leave, and she cries, and, and then she gets another one in her web, and she traps them, and locks them in her mansion, and then she's crying in her marble bathtub surrounded by pearls. <laughs> so I was like, I was like, I can use this. We landed in Terminal 13, no big deal. 18 hour flight. Okay, never mind, that's Terminal 3. I just thought that the, <laughs> the L, L was a... It, the L doubles is a one. Good, of course girl. the L doubles is a one. Want. I'm, I'm sort of fascinated by the waving cats because, uh, you know, of course, as long as you keep fresh batteries in them, they're always going to be saying hello to you. Just always just... Symbolize forever, I think, these waving cats. Just, what's better than a cat that's just always like, hey? There's nothing better than that. I don't know if this means that I've been on a flight for too long, but I think that um, there's a forest in the airport. <laughs> Is it like a mirage or something? No, it's there, because it, you know. Yeah, it's there. This giant raccoon they have. You're not. We'll, we'll wait until our scissors are Okay, let's go play a show. She likes them. She likes them like that. Do you sing your own songs in the shower? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one, yes! Hey guys, I'm gonna give Dylan one punchline to say and then you all die laughing, okay? The punchline is, and it was my foot, okay? Which brings us to Scooter Braun. Ugh. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah. Face. Okay, I'm gonna do it, I guess. <sighs> it's clear that As for me, I'm 90% sure the main reason I'm here is because I have a song called 22. But I'm feeling 22. How does the moon work? And why can we eat salad but not grass? I promise you this time I did not talk to your mom. I'm not going to give any embarrassing videos of you. Wow. Like, like I did last time. Yeah, no, this is all. Yeah, uh, we don't let my mom have a phone around me anymore. <laughs> And I saw a tree, and I go, hey, what's up? And I go, um, I go, what are you doing tonight? And you go, I don't know, we'll probably go play pool or something if you want to hang out. I go, no, no, I meant, what songs are you doing tonight? Like, I'm, <laughs> I'm so old, I can't hang out with you after. I'm so old. I don't want to, I, go, I just want to know what songs you're doing yeah, but tonight. But it is too late o'clock <laughs> I don't that. Know. I was just Grandpa saying, needs to go to sleep, you? man, yeah. I'm like, what are you doing tonight? You're like, I was like, I don't know, where's the party? <laughs> As an experience, so I dug out um, my, my old mood board. Okay. Um, Taylor, those are all pictures of me. No. <laughs> this is a pizza.